Recently this week, we've had loads of DMs talking about the ultimatum. Um, I f- we even started, we started watching it before. Well, you started, you watched it before. You started watching it before me. I think I watched it. I think I was one, I watched yeah. one episode before you started watching it. Yeah. Um, I was going to watch it anyway, but then we had tons and tons and tons of DMs about it. And yeah, we hopped on. We did a quick binge sesh. And, we did. Um, yeah, man, we're, we're about to review the thing. The show is Juicy. The show's it's juicy. juicy. It's juicy. The show's juicy. The, the show's juicy. Juicy. The, the show is so juicy that we had to flip up, switch up our drinking habit just for today. We're going to get bitchy with it. Yeah. <laughs> Sipping through straws. I want to hold my cup the whole time we go for it. <laughs> bitchy with it. <laughs> We're going to get chatty Cathy. Oh, it's... Um... So for those that don't know or haven't seen the trailer or don't know anything about the show Ultimatum, the premise is there are five or six couples in each couple one person um, gave the ultimatum, i.e. they want to get married or by the end of this experience, they're going to le- either leave with someone else or leave, quote unquote, empty handed or single. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, that's basically long story short. For that ultimatum, first three weeks, um, they're with a completely different person. The next three weeks, they're with their original partner. So you can imagine how. Yep. And then they have the... And they have the, the ultimatum, official, like, the official ultimatum at the end. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Who do you choose? Right. So Those... there's going to be bare spoilers going on. Mm, We're going to yeah. do a full breakdown of the season. Yeah. It's going to get juicy. Best parts, worst parts. Favorite characters, least favorite characters. Yeah. Uh, different traits. It's gonna, yeah. We're gonna try and get it done as quickly as possible, but it's probably gonna be a lengthy one. Yeah. So, so it, buckle up. It is a huge spoiler alert. Yeah, and this is the the SNG breakdown of uh, the ultimatum. Okay. Cool. So let's just go through couples. Bet. Let's go through couples. Original couples. Um. Yeah. All original couples. Okay. Okay. First one. Hunter, Hunter and Alexis. Alexis. Yeah. Hunter and Alexis. Alexis doesn't know what she wants. <laughs> she. Is one of the most materialistic people I've ever met. She's a joke. Material, and she, all she knows is finance. That's all she, she wants is the P. That's all she cared about. Fam, she's like twenty five, isn't it? I thought she, she was look it. Fam, I thought she was forty seven. Yeah, she looks old. <laughs> she looks old. She looks old. Fam, she's had work done. She has, and it's At done the, op- it's had the yeah. opposite effect. It's it's weird. Fam, she sat down with Colby and said, "My man needs to be making X, Y, and Z. I want to do this. I want to use do that. this certain lifestyle. Fam, I'm, I'm not looking <laughs> to drop." I'm gonna be. I want to exceed that lifestyle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Colby yeah. sat back. Fam, he said, "Rah, this is not the yacht for me. This is. A, I can't see a future with you, babe." Fam, he literally. She sat him down in the <laughs> restaurant, <laughs> in it, and was like, "Obviously, I'm feeling you." Yeah. We had so a great conversation. We had a great yesterday. conversation. What, go on, what are you saying? The man said, "I'll be honest. I don't see a future with you." She said, "Rah." She said, "What? How can you say that so early on? <laughs> I'm obviously giving myself to you. You're yeah. my favorite, etc. How can you say that so early on?" He said, "Babes." <laughs> I'm just not attracted to you. Like that's literally all there he is to panicked. it. I'm just not attracted to you. He fucking panicked. <laughs> she thought she was the bee's knees when she walked in. She thought she was the buffest thing in there. She thought she would clean up. She literally thought, I'm the buffest thing in here. I'll get whoever I want. The one person she wanted said, Big man, you're not attractive. She ran up to Madeline and said, Colby's a piece of shit and you can do better. <laughs> so embrace this experience. Fam? Fam? She's a hater. She's a hater. She said, embrace this experience. While she was talking to Hunter. Yeah. While she's on a date with your man, she said, enjoy this whole thing. Nah. I know he bought you here, but he's a piece of <coughs> shit. You can do better. Fuck he's a scumbag. Out. Yeah. Fuck it out. She's nasty, you know. <laughs> she is nasty. Alexis is nasty. When she doesn't know? get her way, true colours. Bro. True colours. And then she tried to send for him again in the, on the decision day. At the yes, table. Yes, 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 she did. She tried to send for him She's again. Like, I want to interject. Sorry. I just don't think he's a nice guy. Because Lauren was saying all these nice things or mm. whatever. Or April might have been saying or some nice things. Maybe April, maybe. And she was April. like, I'm sorry to interrupt, mm. but nah, he's just not a nice guy. He's a fake, he's this and that. All because. And then she tried some. Sp- she tried spin a lie. She tried spin a lie and said, basically, said he, out of the blue, he just called her ugly or yeah. something like that. The first, she said the first thing you called me was ugly or something like that. Literally, the first, I tried to have a nice conversation. The first thing out of his mouth is that you're, un, you're, like, you're unattractive. ugly, you're unattractive or something like that. He definitely didn't say That's that. That's a lie! He definitely didn't say that. So, fam, I don't know how these cameramen keep their mouths yeah. shut. You'll hear me, it, like, if I'm the guy with the yeah. mic, these, these boom mic guys, yeah. I'm like, that's a fucking lie. <laughs> and then, you see when the camera pans to me and I got my, my headset on, I'm like that. And I'm like, on the office thing. I'm on the office thing and I'm like, Alexis, that's a fucking <laughs> lie. He never said that. 
I'm gonna stand up for homeboy yeah. because that's a fucking lie. Reel the tapes. Re- Reel the tape up. Reel it up. And then she sat back down, and then it was Hunter's turn to pick. He st- man stood up and said, "Guys, I'm gonna marry Alexis." Sam, guys, I want him. He got so excited. <laughs> I, wa- I went to slap him back down. I went to say, <laughs> "If I was Nick Lachey, I'd have been like, sit the fuck back down." The man stood up. Guys, beaming, is it? I want to marry Alexis. And he's scared. You feel sorry for Alexis. Uh, That's why you want to marry her. Because yeah. you feel sorry for her. Oh, little pussy boy. Sorry, no one man. wants your missus. Uh, that's the worst feeling. It's video. embarrassing. That's the worst feeling. I was thinking if there were icks in this show, main ick is not getting picked by anyone. That's the worst feeling. How can no one want my missus? <laughs> Imagine. I couldn't. <laughs> I genuinely couldn't. <laughs> Imagine you're sat there and no one wants your girl. I'd have to look myself in the mirror. <laughs> because I know they're looking at me. Do you know what I mean? Ra, I couldn't be in there with you. <laughs> Watching your girl get pied and pied and pied again, I'll be looking at you like, bro, are you sure? I'd have to do a substitute We tick. literally can't pay for someone to be with your wife. That's embarrassing. Honestly. I think it's worse from like the guy as well. If you're the guy and no yats picking you, it's so embarrassing. Which brings me on to Nate. <sighs> Nate's a villain. He's a villain. Of the, he was yeah, the yeah, villain yeah. of the show. Yeah. I, I wish he stayed longer. <laughs> I wish he stayed longer. He was a villain. <laughs> wow. He Bam. said, if I'm going down, so is everyone. Yeah. Oh, bro. Sorry. I keep itching my eye. I've got some fucking hair or something in my eyes. It's killing me. Bro, Nate was such a villain. Oh, my goodness. Ma- oh, my goodness. <laughs> he spent the whole first week... In his head, he was thinking, I need to finesse as many mm. hoes as possible. Mm. I need to give them my all. He gave the ultimatum, in it. He the, yeah. gave the ultimatum to his girl, Lauren. Lauren. Because she doesn't want kids. kids and yes. he needs kids. <laughs> that's Quote, all unquote, he, he needs that's kids. That's all he was talking about throughout the whole thing. The first I want to be a dad. all he was talking about. I want to be a dad. I want to be a dad. He thought he had Shanique and April wrapped up. <sighs> he thought he had Shanique and April wrapped when sh- up. <laughs> when Shanique didn't pick him. He, he took a deep breath. He was breath. in the interview room. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, what's going on? What's what wrong with me? What the fuck is going on? What's wrong with me? I said, what the fuck is going on? And then, he, and then he immediately turned to April and was like, I don't know what anyone else thinks, but me and April had, were like this. We had a connection. We had a connection. We both want kids. We were, blah, 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 blah. April stood up and said, everything he said is correct. But, but Hunter? <laughs> what Hunter did for man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't do Hunter for man. Hunter listens to man. <laughs> Hunter listens to man. And that's what I need. I need a listener. Nate's not a listener. He's a chat, chat, chatter. Hunter listens. And when I was having a breakdown, he was there. He was he, the only one there for me. Yeah, literally. He was the only one there. So I picked Hunter. Nate said, no, 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 no. Twice. No. In one sitting. In one sitting. Par twice. twice. He got par twice. And then Hunter stood up and married Alexis. And then Hunter stood up and married Alexis. <laughs> and then Nate's thinking, I've got no one got, left. And he whispered to man. None of them would have been picked. <laughs> Madeline's already been picked. And I said, I'm going to choose you. I'm going to choose you. I'm going to choose you. She's like, what? <laughs> She's like, what? She thought, Who even are you? Who? We've not We've spoken never spoke. past Monday. I'm going to choose you. You already know I'm with Randall. I chose Randall and Randall chose me. What are you on about, We're locked mate? up. What are you actually on about? You're desperate. He's clutching <laughs> at straws. <laughs> then it was fucking, um, what's his name? Colby's time to speak. Oh, Colby he laid sh- it on thick. He showered Lauren. Showered Lauren. <laughs> she was ready to leave her man. Oh, hundred. She was it in a lip. She was ready to leave her man. Oh. She, when Alexis tried to say something about Colby, mm. Lauren jumped in, defended oh, him. Facts. facts. Defended him. Because I already saw it. Lauren and Colby seemed like they would bang, bro. They would bang, bro. Lauren's a painting. She's a baddie. Can't stand her voice, but yeah. she's a she's, painting. She's a baddie. She's Ooh. a baddie. The, the tats as well, all of that. Oh, God. Sexy, yeah. Hella sexy. So, yeah, Lauren Lauren was down, 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 down for Colby. Oh, Colby said everything before, literally before Lauren was about to stand up to pick whoever she was going to pick. She was about to say, Colby, let's go. Colby, let's fucking go. Nate stood up like a pussy. <sighs> After the fact that Hunter already proposed, he stood up. I don't want to take anyone's spotlight. But I need to do this. I need to do this. I need to do this. There is no family without Lauren. You're a waste man. You're a liar. You're a liar. You just did this because you've got nothing left. You've got nothing left. (laughs) You're in Alexis' shoes. It's just you and Alexis in the corner. (laughs) 
and you, you said you can't be stuck with her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, literally, your your only option was to to give up on having kids or spend three weeks three weeks with Alexis, <laughs> and you couldn't, you couldn't, you couldn't fathom yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you couldn't fathom that. <laughs> you thought, fuck it, I'm fuck going on it. one knee. <laughs> I'd rather never have a kid. It's the only thing I want from my life, but I'd rather give up my only dream than spend three weeks with this hoe. <laughs> then spend three weeks with this hoe. So, Lauren, marry me, please. Marry me, please. Get me off the show. Fat, marry me. And my rating for Lauren went from 110 down to zero. Oh, zero. As soon as she said fucking I yes. I couldn't believe she said yes. <laughs> Bro, when he got up and proposed or was proposing, fam, I was wincing. I wanted I her could, to smack him in the face. I couldn't breathe. I was like, this can't be possible. Literally. One, and she can't even. She can't say yes. Surely she can't say yes. She so must respect herself enough to say no. So this is going to be embarrassing for everyone. That brings me on to Colby. He's a cheat. <laughs> Colby, a liar and a cheat. A liar and a fucking cheat. A manipulative liar. <laughs> he tried to get. He tried to throw Zay's name under the bus. Our boy Zay, bro. Nah. On guys' night. Couldn't believe. It. Man said. He was whispering to some yak, <laughs> and out of nowhere, the yak tried to kiss me. Mm. So he said, no, 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 no. We're not playing this little game. You're a cheat. So tell everyone you're a cheat. And tell the truth. Tell us what happened. You lips her. Don't say she tried to kiss you and you Don't throw away. me under the bus. You were lips in her. This, that, that's, that's the episode that got juicy, juicy to me. So if just for context, right? For about what, what's happening to Colby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so obviously, Colby's the one that gave the ultimatum because he wanted to marry his Mrs. Madeline. He is now wanted to choose another chick, i.e. Lauren, who then got proposed to and she said yes. So now he's stuck. He ended up choosing April, which we'll come to. Yeah. And they've been coupling up for three weeks now. So Colby's now gone out with the mandem and lipsed another thing, not even April. Nothing to do with Nothing the show. Nothing to do with the show. <laughs> he's gonna lips the random or offset. And then come back to tell the boys as if to say Zay was the one that tried to persuade him to do it. That brings me on to fucking April. Oh my God. April is... April, she said she was crazy. Yeah, she's legitimately crazy. How can she say her man is laying on the sofa? Oh, so this is fast forward. April and Jake, mm -hmm. original couple. This is, they're back together now for three weeks. So this is after the fact that Jake was with Ray, who they picked each other for the first few weeks. So April's back. She went through his Apple Watch, was it? No, or she his went iPhone. through, went through his, his, his phone. Because he came home drunk. His phone was unlocked. Phone. Went through it. And we saw, the, we saw the night vision, in it. She swiped the phone. Oh, 100%. Swiped the phone. Swiped through it. it. She saw Ray's ass twerking on the phone. Airdropped the videos to herself. <laughs> she was like, I'm crazy. So I airdropped it to myself for proof. <laughs> I couldn't believe that. I mean, I, don't get me wrong. I, I get it. <laughs> don't get me wrong. Of course I get it. I, everyone gets it. But don't go through my phone. Yeah, don't bro. go through my phone. That's a violation. Yeah, don't go through my phone, bro. Don't she do was, it. She openly said it. Like, I'm so crazy, candidly. so I went through your phone. And then I airdropped everything to myself. Because I know you're going to delete them anyway. <laughs> Bye. I airdropped them to myself. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Fuck you and fuck the shit. While show. I'm asleep in the other room. You're doing all of this. Fuck you. No, she wasn't in the, He was in bed. She was at the foot of the bed. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. True. She the didn't night vision showed it all. Yeah, I forgot about she that. She didn't bit. even leave the room. Fuck you and fuck this show. I'm gone. <laughs> I'm gone. Bro, 100%. Two and a half years down the drain, I'm gone. Yeah, 100%. Twerk, no twerk, I'm gone. 100%. You can't. That's my one cardinal rule. That's... You can never go through my phone. 100%. You're crazy. So that then brings me on to Jake and Ray. Yes. Jake and Ray. So for context, Jake arrived with April. She mm. gave him the ultimatum. Mm -hmm. um, Ray arrived with Zay, who we'll get on to. She gave him the ultimatum. Mm -hmm. Never would have guessed it. Never would have guessed it. She gave him the ultimatum. So Jake and Ray are basically soulmates. They are. They're basically soulmates. Yeah. From the second they started talking, they were clicking and clicking and clicking. Anyway, fast forward. They picked each other. They moved in together. And they were lips in in minutes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they were the first couple to lips. They were the first couple to lips. She lips did. Lips him straight off the bat. And he kept trying to back up a little bit. And she... Mm -hmm. mwah, <laughs> yeah, give me those lips. Mwah, mwah. She was down yeah, for Jake. Yeah, she was down. She loved Jake. <sighs> and this is the thing as well. These men are trying to tell us that they didn't fuck that whole three weeks. That's a lie. Some of them fucked. They had a... Well, I'm saying specifically Jake and Ray. Okay. 
because we know Zayn. Because of that box. The sex box. They had a sex box. They had a sex box. And these men are trying to tell me they didn't fuck. They're just tickling feet and shit with feathers. Blindfolds and Don't feathers and shit. Don't lie to me. Whose sex box was it? Jake and Ray's. Because Zay found it when he came home. No, no, no. Whose original sex box was it? I think it was Jake's. For Jake and April? I don't know. Who, no, I think he bought it f just for him and Ray. No. Yeah. I think he bought that box just for them two. Mad. Yeah, mad. Z I'm, I'm surprised Zay didn't punch someone. Oh. <laughs> Same. He went through it the he, whole time. He had a roller coaster of events that guy. Oh, he did. Bless him. He did. Bless him. He did, he did, he, he did. He felt like he felt like the kid of the show. Oh, 100 percent But a lot of times he acted like it. Towards the end. Towards the end, he did. Like yeah. two thirds in, he was acting like yeah. an idiot. He was frustrated. <laughs> James. You pushed, they pushed him. They pushed my boy Zay. You just push and push and push. Eventually you're gonna see the lion. And that's what they saw. Man went out and clapped someone's cheeks. <laughs> 8 a.m. He clapped someone's cheeks. <laughs> he went out on a night out frustrated and fucked someone. 100%. So context, um, Zay was with... Zay and Ray were the original couple. Yep. Zay went with um, Shanique. Those are the two that he, they picked each other. So they were with each other for three weeks. Then when Zay came back with Ray, they spent three weeks together. During the first week, they were bickering and arguing. And Zay was pouring his heart... The thing with Ray... Ray isn't expressive. Ray's the female, by the way. Mm -hmm. Zay is the male, just for clarification. So Ray isn't expressive about her emotions and her feelings towards Zay. Even, but she's more physical. She said, I can show you. She's always like, I can show you. I can show you. Fam. They fuck every day. They lips all the time. That that's stuff their, was frustrating me. That's the connection she has with him. Whereas Zay wants more than that. He wants, he wants to know. Tell me. Literally, tell, tell me, me with words. Tell me how you me. feel about me. Literally. That's all he wants. Do you want to marry me? Yes or no? Wagwan, if you don't tell me why, if you do tell me why, that's all he was asking throughout Literally. the whole six weeks. That's all he was asking. So he asked her again. He was saying to her, I'm ready to get engaged to you. I'm ready to do... Go Even to the though she yards. gave him the she ultimatum. She gave him the ultimatum and said, I'm ready to do everything with you, blah, blah, blah. She said, she said... I can't speak about this right now. I've got a headache. I need to shower. I need to go to bed. She said, my nose is running. My I nose is medicine. running. I need medicine. I need to shower. I need to go to bed. Man said, please just tell me just how you feel. to me. I'm your man. <laughs> Two and a half years. Bro. No wonder he went out to 8 a.m. Fuck you and your text. Oh, 100%. This is the thing as well. I was actually on Zay's side mm. to a point mm. where like when he rolled out for that, after that, like a pool in display yeah. of me saying to you, look, you brought me on this show because you wanted to marry me. Yeah. I've spent three weeks without you. I'm now back and I'm telling you, I'm ready to get married. Let's basically lock the show. Yeah. The, sh the, the point of the show has been accomplished. Yeah. Facts. I'm ready to get married. Let's go. Let's do it. Facts. Tell me how you feel. How do you feel? She mm. won't say nothing. Tell me how you feel. Mm. I'm trying to get married. What are you saying? She said, I just, my nose is running. I want to go to bed. I said, all right, bet. Say less. Say less. So I'm on your side. Fuck you in terms of, oh, you're not allowed. No matter what happened, all these, all the girls, all this stuff, no matter what happens, you can't just roll in at 8am. I'll do what I want, thank you very much. Because you're basically telling me you don't want to be with me. Facts. Without saying it. Facts. You're, I'm pouring my heart out to you and you won't even answer me. Facts. I'll come in in three days time if I want to. Thank you very much. <laughs> because I'm, you're basically telling me I'm single now. Yeah. So I'll act Facts. single. Facts. If you're going to treat me like shit, I'll treat you like shit. And I'll rock up. Well, I'll be home when I'm home. Whenever I want to be home. It's our yard. He, they made him to be the villain in that yeah, whole thing. They did. They didn't give a fuck about what drove him there. Mm. Just mm. about what he did. Mm. And then in the uh, thingy, Ray had that chest to start shouting at him. Had that chest to start shouting at him. And he was saying, look, I take full accountability. Mm. Oh, this is because him and Shanique banged. Him and Shanique banged. Mm, 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 and he didn't tell her. Mm -hmm, Shanique mm -hmm. told Randall, mm -hmm. but he didn't tell her. Mm -hmm. So she started going mad and he was trying to tell her, I take full accountability. Yeah. She's like, stop fucking shouting at me. Stop fucking shouting at me. You're all shouting at me. Try to speak me. over me, blah, Don't blah, speak blah. over me. Oh. Man's like, am I? I'm just I, Am talking. I in a different dimension? Yeah, I'm just talking. Someone, he said, someone help me. He literally turned to someone and said, help me. She's man, not listening. Man walked off. Sam. Oh, he walked off and said, say less. I'm done with this. Yeah, this is silly. I'm done with you and I'm done with this. <laughs> Run me my check and let me get out of this get silly little studio. Show, man. Because Vanessa Lachey is a manipulator herself. <laughs> she cries when she wants to cry. She shouts when she wants to shout. This is the Vanessa Lachey show. And I don't want to be a part of it for another fucking second. That then brings me on to uh, Randall and... Uh, Madeline. Madeline. Oh Madeline wants to slob his knob. Madeline's a whore. From day one. 
She Fu had she ten to be- seconds into this show. She said him <laughs> before she even knew what she was yeah. there for. Yeah. She said him. him. I want him. Uh, she is a whore. The sexual chemistry slash tension they had, juicy. Ooh. Juicy. Ooh. Oh, she wants the lips from the jump. 100%. Lips and fuck from the she jump. She was bawling that they didn't bang. She was crying her eyes out all the time. And then <laughs> when she got twist up, she's like, why is it when the cameras are off, you're all this and that, your lips are me up. Every time the camera's on, bro, I'm trying to fuck. You don't want to do nothing. You don't want to do messing. nothing. Shh, the camera's on. <laughs> Randall's, Randall's an actor. He's an actor and I don't trust him, Fuad. I don't trust him. I don't trust that boy as far as I can throw him because he was manipulating situations. Yeah. He was lips in her up off camera. Oh, lips in her up. And she's in tears. Mm. And man's just like, shh, stop, 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 stop. Same thing with Shanique. Shanique, yep. When they have their little link up, mm. shh, it's all shh, shh, shh. <laughs> Man said, I'm just doing the show. I'm, sh- I'm g- trying to give the full experience. You invited me on the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You gave me the ultimatum. That was his fullback all the time. You gave me the ultimatum. <laughs> you gave me the ultimatum. I thought <laughs> Shanique, if I would have been like, big man, if you say ultimatum one more fucking time, <laughs> see what I do to you. Bro, Randall's a manipulator. <laughs> Bro? He's a manipulator. <laughs> but you know what I think, Randall? I think the only reason... I Actually, this is mad. <clears throat> I actually don't think Randall was attracted to Madeline in the slightest. You think? I think... If you look at Shanique and her personality, mm. I think Randall just wanted a woman that worships him. That's what I think he's looking for. It could have been Madeline, it could have been anyone else. Okay. I think he just got off on the fact of how badly she wanted him. Because she told him from the jump. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, and obviously mm-hmm. she's not hideous. Mm-hmm. But I think the way Randall saw Madeline was just, this is a yacht that wants me. Will bend over backwards. For me. Will literally bend over backwards, frontwards, sidewards, whatever I want. Because he, they asked about sex. Is there anything off limits? She said, nah, I'll please my man in all sorts oh, of Oh, she said, I'll do anything. Anything. There's nothing off limits. He said, anything? She said, anything. He got a solid boner. <laughs> <laughs> he got a solid oh, boner when she said that. I don't doubt that. Fam, I would have been looking at the sunset like, let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> I would have covered my mic and be like, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, come on, come on. Just, yeah, 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 come on. You just hear bare muffling. Muffles, yeah. Yeah, let's go. Come come toilet, come toilet. You can't I, I would have written it down. Yeah. <laughs> come toilet. I would have dipped my finger in the pool and just read it on the concrete. <laughs> that, I'll that, smash it off when you read it. <laughs> Bro? Dipped my finger in the pool. <laughs> That's hilarious. I would have let the sun dry it up. Oh, Come she's a freak. <laughs> oh, she wanted to bang him. Oh, she wanted to do. She she wanted to do it so bad she was crying she her was eyes crying out. Crying her eyes out. Like Randall, why? Why? At the girls girls' drinks. Went to Shanique. She's like, oh, Randall's a maiden. Randall's this, Randall's that. She wanted a fight. She's like, Shanique was gonna, ready to I'm knock. I'm gonna her go out. back upstairs and lips Randall. In front of Shanique? Yo. She didn't give a shit. That's disrespectful. With her drunk man. eyes. She, was drunk, has she dr- was drunk throughout the whole show. <laughs> she was drunk throughout the whole show. <laughs> Bro, it didn't make sense. <laughs> Madeline, Madeline stayed drunk for the whole ultimatum. She stayed drunk from the moment she arrived to the moment she left. She was just drunk. She was drunk throughout the whole show. Bro. Okay, cool. So that brings me on to Shanique. Shanique, in my opinion, was the buffest guy on that show. Fam. Buffy's out on that show. Fam, her in the fucking reunion? Oh, Shanique was beautiful in that whole show. Buffy's out on the show. I was like, gang. She's banging. Banging. Just even at her like, parents' yard and everything, I was just like, bang. She's got the best genetics. Her yeah, dad looks yeah. my age. I couldn't <laughs> believe that was her father. <laughs> Shanique and Zay have sexual tension. They About did. three or four times mm. they had fucking sexual mm, tension mm, 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 mm. i'm surprised they didn't just go at it from the jump i'm surprised but every time they got close mm. they would ruin it because of his his hot temper mm. but mm. also also shanique as well she's a bully like slyly like the way she would just be like um what did she do the first time they ever argued i can't remember what it was but she was being so patronizing mm. Um, that was it when she was pulling the face expressions ah uh, okay, okay so okay. she would say her part mm. and then when he says his part she'd be like oh mm. and, then, and he's like what's with the fa- if you want to say something mm. just say it mm. and she's like raw like if you can't even handle My facial face expressions, expressions we can't do this we can't do this kind of thing mm. and he's like big man it's not about that it's like he even said like 
it's not about the facial expressions. It's the fact that like you can say something without talking. Mm -hmm. So you're clearly saying something, mm -hmm. but you refuse to verbalize it. I'm just telling you to verbalize it. Mm -hmm. And she just walked off. So Shanique and Zay, they had sexual tension mm -hmm. and then they actually fucked that one night, didn't they? Mm -hmm. um, well, it doesn't, it doesn't say they fucked. Did they, did they, what did they say in the reunion? They, they did said, something. Fam, in the reunion... They didn't, say, they didn't say they fucked. They didn't say they fucked, but... He said, what's one thing you learned from your partner? And then Shanique said, olive oil you can use as lube. They fucked. They fucked. I can't believe she said that. <laughs> because Bro, if I'm said, Randall, I'm punching her in a temple. <laughs> Are you taking the piss out of me? On live TV. On live television. You're telling me, you're basically telling the world that homeboy couldn't fit his fat dick in you. So I had to run around the kitchen looking for lube. Naked. Naked. And lathered up some olive oil on there and slid it in you. <laughs> That's what you're telling the world. After right I proposed and we're broken up now. Yeah. Nah. nah. Man's pro man thought, fuck, I wish I fucked with Madeline. Oh, 100%. And now she's pregnant. Exactly. When that's come round, he's thinking, fuck, I wish I've banged Madeline. Because you were out here getting clarted <sighs> by yeah. Zay's fat yeah. dick. <laughs> you were getting clarted by six foot five Zay. The sex would have popped. I already know the sex would have popped. Oh, well, after they rolled over, yeah. panting, innit? Oh, yeah. Her headscarf was a jar. <laughs> a jar. A skew. <laughs> they rolled over, panting after they fucked. Fuck. Ooh. Uh, yeah, and like, they, they were both frustrated with what was going on. Yeah. From yeah, all parties. Yeah, yeah, they needed to release some. Oh. I don't know how these, I honestly don't know how these men didn't bang every night. I actually Same. don't know how they didn't bang every night. Same. Because after we fucked the first time, we're it's banging on. On. every single day. And morning, before I leave. morning after the night. <laughs> before I leave. If I've got four days left, I need to get it in. I need to get in. I will deal with the repercussions at the reunion. <laughs> because doing it once or doing it 10 times is the same it's shit. It, I've banged. I've cheated. <laughs> so we might as well go. It's the ultimatum. I need to find out what I want to do. <laughs> do you know what I mean? And I'm still on the fence. <laughs> so run me that tum again and again and again until I know until for I'm sure. sure. Run me those <laughs> cheeks. Run me those fucking cheeks until I'm certain. <laughs> Please. <laughs>